I have to work. I am sexy. I am sexy. Why am I working? What is this? Well, there you go. What's going on, party people? What is going on? It's your ride share extraordinaire. Your super duper Uber drivers here, guys. That's right. That's right. Thank you. Thank you. You far too kind. You guys already know the deal. Before you hop in my ride, do me a quick favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. Por favor. <laughs> Come on. Let's do this. Hop on in. Buckle in. And let's go. Yeah! Okay, okay. Party people, welcome back. Thank you for hitting that subscribe button. What are we talking about today, folks? What are we talking about today? Man, so Memorial Day 2018, this young lady here goes on a date and she meet up with this dude here, okay? Now, they went out on a date a couple of times and this is in California. So Mr. Buddy here pulls out the bong, packs it in with the weed wow. and offered it to a young lady. Young lady said, okay, and start taking her whiff. She take two big hits off the bong and went cuckoo for Cocoa Pops. <laughs> she saw the first thing she could get was a knife and went up to Buddy and started slashing. <laughs> One time, two times, 20 times, 30 times, 100 times. She stabbed Buddy 100 times to his demise. Now, she even went after the dog. She went for the dog, which was her own dog, slash dog neck. She went to the bathroom, put the neck, put the knife to her neck and tried to do it herself. But she was, you know, kind of skittish about it, I guess. She calls the police. They comes and arrest her and they put her away for the last six years. Right. Well, I think she was out on bail. But today the judge had made a sentence. The judge gave her a hundred hours community service. What? Unbelievable. A hundred hours of community service. Now you guys know. Huh? If this was big city like New Orleans, Miami, Atlanta, Chicago, those, knuck those knuckleheads in Chicago, if they were smoking a blunt, load up the AK, go down the street, an old, old block, and start laying people down, and they catch him. Do you think they give him a hundred hours community service? Talking about, I had a psychotic break. No. No. Of course not. Of course not. You guys, you, there's a lot of potheads on my stream. I know. I get it. I used to be one too. All right. But I don't smoke no more because it's just too powerful. This is too much TAC in it. Now that the government involved, I'm a little, I'm a little skittish about it. Because back then when we was entrepreneurs and we trying to sell our shit and try to make some extra money to feed our peoples, they put a stop to it. They throw us in jail and we got a record, right? Not me, of course, but you know what I'm talking about. Okay. And um, now that the government involved, they made it legal. They're selling it. They making it more powerful. They package it in, in, in edibles with colorful packaging for kids to get addicted to it. Oh my so gosh. I don't want no parts of it because some parts of the country are not going to get the help they need if they do become addicted to the the, the weed. <laughs> you know, it's like a gateway drug. Once you start doing the cigarettes, then you do weed and then you start doing harder stuff. All right. But we have some states like Colorado, California, they have rehab centers that's going to take care of the people that's been addicted to it. You people <clears throat> in New Orleans, in Houston, in Atlanta, if you get addicted to it, oh, well, there ain't nobody come helping you. There's nobody come helping you. You see California, they have all these meth um, methadones and giving away free needles to their people to take care of, you know. But if that happens to you, in our cities, it's going to be like the 80s, the crack days of the 80s. So 
I'm telling you guys, stay away from that. Stay away from the devil's lettuce. <laughs> stay away from the wacky tobacco. Because I'm telling you, they are putting things in it. It's much stronger. They could put, uh, it's man-made now. It's not, don't, don't, I don't hear nothing about it's from the earth and all that. Shit. Bullshit. It's man-made now. It is GMO. All right. It is GMO weed. Modified. All right. So you guys, if you want to enjoy yourself, you might have a psychotic episode and they're not going to give you a hundred hours community service. Not like this young lady. No, sir. So tell your kids, stay away from it. And if you're over 50, come on, man. Party's over. The party's over. Put it down. Air it out. Get your taste buds back. The hell do I know? I'm just a driver. <laughs> if you guys got any value of my content, do me a favor. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. You see that notification bell? Turn on that notification bell so you get my latest and greatest. Share this content with your best friends. Tell your mama I said hi. All right, all right. Till next time, I'll see you again. And all you potheads, get off my lawn.